kinds of devices the attack could be me from my mind goes to my heart is anger my family almost gave up on me but I didn't no matter how much how many times she kicked me out of the house <laughs> she, she, no matter how many times she tell me leave us but I didn't I don't want to lose my family, my children. Because they're my life. Even though I'm a drug addict, I can say I'm a drug addict. I'm an alcoholic. There comes a time I was very harsh to my children and to my wife. I always fight. And there comes a time, there comes a time that uh, we had a fight one day because we had a misunderstanding. I ended up in jail for for battering her head, but I didn't mean it. I told the judge that I, I didn't mean it. We just had a misunderstanding. But if she didn't drop the case. I might be in jail, maybe until now, or wherever. <laughs> but still, after that, I didn't, I didn't change. I still keep continuing doing drugs. And then she wants to kick me out again, but I never, I never, I don't want, I don't want. Until uh, one day we, we uh, decided that uh, I had to leave. I need to go somewhere else. And we talk about it, and then I agreed. And then we find out that uh, the place where I'm going to, where, where the job is, my friend's leaving that job, so I decided not to go. So I'm still with them until now. Maybe God has a plan. Because that's why I didn't go. Until, and then that day, By the grace of God, and He is merciful for each and everyone, I found Jesus Christ, the love of my soul, to the elder ministry. Thank you, Pastor Rick, Sister Stella, and to all my brethren for all your encouragement. I'm tiring and patient to know more about Jesus Christ, that He died for me and my sins. And now, my family and my wife, my children is here now together to serve Lord Jesus because of God and mercy. Now I will say, I am free. I am the servant of God through Christ Jesus. He strengthened me, He saved me, and He rescued me from the bandage of sin. Amen. Amen. I am more than conquer through Christ Jesus Christ. Woo! And I would like to take this opportunity to say uh, thank you to all the brethren, Pastor Rick, Sister Stella, for uh, offering a prayer to my uh, brother who uh, just passed away last Thursday. Uh, I will say a Bible verse. Uh, the Bible says we will rejoice always, even though my heart is full of sadness and sorrow. In Ecclesiastes chapter 3, verse 2, there's a time to be born and a time to die. What as a Christian Paul said in Philippians chapter 1, verse 21, to die is gain. Amen. And I believe in my heart that my brother is in the hands of Creator of heaven and earth. Amen. That's all thank you so much.